have you ever looked back on any of the vlogs or any of the blogs and just thought, I can't, I can't imagine that coming out of my brain? In a good way or a bad way? Either. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's just, it was just so fun in the early days. You know, it was like my top 20 blushes. I don't even own 20 blushes now. You know, it was just, just it was such a what can I do next? You know, it was just go, 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 mm -hmm. go. It felt so exciting. And then, yeah, I'm sure a lot of the things I did in my vlogs, I wouldn't necessarily say or do or. Have you ever deleted anything? Yeah, I've deleted all my old videos. Yeah, I've deleted from that relationship. Right. Mostly, and people ask me why, and, and people really want to go back and watch it because it's nostalgic for them, I think. But mostly for his privacy. Mm -hmm. And, you know, he has a life. And I don't think it's fair that I should have that up. And also, it was just such a different time. So, and also for my relationships, why it's not nice for someone to see with their act, you know? Yeah. It just doesn't need to be up there. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm kind of starting fresh a little bit. I even went through my old Instagram posts. I think that's really healthy. It is, and it felt so good. I think it's really, I did a podcast six months ago, not even six months ago, and I was listening back to it because it got published recently. And I said something and I was like, oh, I've changed my mind since then. And I felt kind of, God, that happened really quickly. Yeah. But I would have stood by what I said so hard and so vehemently. And yet when I was listening to it, I was like, oh no, I've moved on since then. Mm. And I think it can be quite um, tethering sometimes to have something, your opinion, that no longer stands out in the world. Yes. Well, I try not to share opinions. Do you now? <laughs> if I can avoid it, yeah. Because you do change so much. Mm. You change so much. I mean, I'm getting all my tattoos lasered off for that exact reason. I've changed. Mm. How is that going, by the it way? Hurts. It looks so painful. <laughs> it hurts so much. <laughs> But okay, so this is like a proper. This is like a spiritual. Rebirth this is a that thing for me. Yeah, it's a big. It's a big letting go time for me. I, I feel like I, I'm already almost done it, but I just need these tattoos to peace out. Interesting. Yeah. What sparked it? I realized that I couldn't really move forward in my current relationship if I was still holding on to the past. And the past, even if I thought I wasn't holding on to it. Somewhere I was holding on to it mm -hmm. because those videos were still up or my those posts were still up or, you know, my, with my tattoos, it was really of the time for me. And I just, I just want to just let it go. Let it go. And actually, do you get um, acupuncture? I, I'm actually, I've had it a few times. I'm having it with in the next few weeks. Okay. Well, anyway, apparently I have a blockage in my large intestine. <laughs> And it's, I have a problem letting go. I'll let you fill in the blanks. Not physically, although <laughs> it all is manifests. Your, okay. Is, anything is wrong with my life. My gut is the first thing that we're yes. like, okay, something's not 100%. Yeah. Right. Are you the same? I'm exactly the same. So I'm like, this is me mm. all the time. So I'm really trying to like soften, soften things. I'm like. Relax. Relax. Let go. And that's part of my process. Yeah. 